All right, welcome back, everybody. Uh, today I'm going to show you uh, one of my favorite saltwater trolling lures, and that is the Bomber HST8. You can see here I have got four different ones laid out here. Two of them are rigged uh, with a leader material, and then the other two do not have uh, leader materials. But I'm going to do a little little walkthrough on these guys and let you see, um, without having to purchase them, what they look like how they perform and also um, what I feel is, is good quality and bad quality when it comes to them. Alright, I'm going to use this red one here as an example. Um, these lures have pretty good detail to them. There's not much else that's uh, different between the Yozuri um, Bonita lures that are sold except for the price. You can pick these up for about $10 to $15 a piece. Um, I have actually picked up a set of four, which is right here. Um, I picked these up for $25 for the set of four, just different colors, and um, overall they are for high speed trolling, that's what the HST is about, and uh, the eight is for, um, they are eight inches long. Um, the thickness of them, they are about an inch to an inch and a quarter thick, they do have the flat portion of the head here that allows it to dive pretty deep, uh, trolling at speeds of uh, about 10 knots is about what we usually run them at. They do shake side to side very well in the water, so they have a realistic look of a fleeing bait fish. Um, the hooks on them, that is one of the downfalls. I recommended everyone change out the hooks to a little bit heavier grade. However, these hooks are welded on the seam right here. And um, that is one good thing, but they are very skinny. Very small, lighter weight hooks than what I would prefer to catch Wahoo or King with. Um, but overall, it's, it's pretty good pretty good design it does have the one wire system so the wire at the top here runs down through the body to the bottom and then all the way through the back and then it comes out so it is all made of one piece they can really take a beating um, I've seen these get tore up by all sort of pelagic species everything from larger bull mahi or dolphin to wahoo king mackerel um, they have really torn them up so it's by far one of my favorite trolling lures that's why I have so many. Let's give you a rundown on how I rig them. I just use this right here, which is 80 pound coated stainless steel uh, leader material. I double crimp it just so there's no question of, uh, of it coming un uncrimped when I uh, get a fish on. And I use a pretty heavy duty swivel. These swivels right here are uh, 130 pound swivels. So um, overall, I really love these lures. I recommend that everyone who trolls in salt water own a couple of them and uh, they do come in various uh, various colors so you just kind of play around with it and see what would work best for you and uh, there you have it the bomber HST 8 high-speed trolling lure thanks for watching